In this video, I will illustrate how to remove a tripod head from a Manfrotto tripod. This would be applicable to all tripods. I will be replacing this tripod head from Manfrotto from a tripod base by Manfrotto. It will be replaced with this ball head. I'm choosing this ball head so I can do leveling a lot easier without adjusting the legs of the tripod. So our first step is to extend the tripod center. We need to do this so that we can gain access to the three screws that are on the underside of the tripod head. Our next step is then to loosen those three screws and remove them from the tripod. Here I remove them all the way. You don't really need to remove them all the way off the tripod. You need to make them loose enough where the tripod head will spin and loosen from the base. This is an optional step. I chose to remove the arm from the tripod head just to make it easier to rotate and to get it out of my way. You want to tighten any screws that you have that would allow the tripod head to spin normally by clamping them down and now we can spin the tripod head loose and it will rotate away from the tripod base. Here's the tripod head that I chose. I chose a ball head versus a video head because I was finding most of my shooting lately has been outdoors rather than indoors. I'm always on different ground of varying elevations. And I was just tired of always adjusting the tripod legs to get the camera level. So I just wanna be able to quickly set the tripod out, not worry about level of the tripod itself and just rotate the ball head with the camera on it and make the camera level. All right, so next we need to thread on the new head to the base. Pretty straightforward, just spin it around and then make sure you have it firmly tight. Then we just need to tighten those three screws on the bottom of the tripod to tighten the tripod head to the tripod so it does not spin loose. Now this head was a 3 8 inch tripod head. That was the threading. So make sure to check your tripod before ordering a head to make sure what the threads are in terms of the, whether it be 3 8 inch or quarter inch. I believe most of the heads are gonna be 3 8 inch. So that's all there was to replacing the tripod. Here I'm just illustrating this ball head that I ordered from Amazon. You can rotate the base. It has markings for different degrees. And here you can loosen and tighten the ball. So this is where you would loosen that. And then you're able to rotate the ball freely until the camera is level. And once you tighten that knob, then the camera does not move. You need to clamp it down a little bit more than what I show in this video. Here's my camera with this ball head. Let's say I'm on uneven ground. I just need to pivot the camera. My camera does have a level indicator in the screen, so I can just look at that. And once it's level, go ahead and clamp down the ball head. You can also put it in a vertical position, but by doing this, obviously, then I need to adjust my legs on the tripod again in order to compensate for uneven ground. So ideally, it would be best suited for horizontal use. And that's all there is to replacing a tripod head. Make sure to comment below what you believe is the best tripod of all time and what your favorite tripod head to use is. Please consider watching some of my other videos on my YouTube channel and subscribing. See you in the next video.